Hello everybody. It's Tuesday, Tuesday, Tuesday. Yeah, we are out and about. Tromping around. The usual Tuesday thing. What are we gonna talk about this morning? Well, let's I'll tell you what we're gonna talk about. Let's talk a little bit about well yesterday was the the, the eclipse going across the United States. talk about that well I'm not going to talk about what the usual thing is about it all of everybody looking up going ooh ah I'm going blind no even though they, uh, they, they got special glasses and stuff for it no what we'll talk about is how it affected our weather and yes the uh, the weather channel actually reported on this which, which is kind of like it must have been a slow day. Type thing. But yeah. One thing I need to say, it must have been a slow day. Because I uh, I mean I was out I was out in it and I just kind of figured it was normal totally normal which what it was. Because <sighs> I was I was riding on the eclipse before, during and shortly after the eclipse. I have the videos to show, there's actually ones posted today before you see this. But yeah, the temperatures actually dropped during the eclipse. It was whenever I started riding on one ride, it was like in the mid 90s. And whenever I on the eclipse, done time on the eclipse, it actually dropped down to the mid 80s. So that was like, I mean, I would say between seven and eight, uh, seven to ten degrees. So it's like, yeah. And uh, that type of drop, I mean, like, you put on a vast area. I mean, that's definitely going to have something to do with the uh, with the weather patterns for a little bit gonna goof it up around a little bit which I mean uh, uh, whenever I get into the lighted areas you'll see it more but I actually wearing my rain jacket and it's not raining because they are actually calling for thunderstorms for all day today except for early in the morning well just last night they were just calling for it even in the morning so like yeah I wear my rain jacket my rain jacket I mean, personally, I mean, I, I'm not, I'm not afraid of the rain or anything. It is, I don't care to get, get wet unless I have to. I absolutely have to. It'll be all. It's all right. But yeah, I mean, if you think about it, it would. It does affect the. Uh, I mean, the moon affects the affects our weather. The eclipse would do. Or it's going to do the same thing. Different routes. It's going to affect it too. Lady Elaine. Oh, got this thing on there. And, oh, shoot. I, one guy I should not be watching on YouTube at all. I and mean, his video just popped up. And I could, I'm like, how these people on crack? I only watched the first, like, freaking maybe four minutes, five minutes of it. Uh, yeah, Alex Jones. Yeah. Oh, I'll tell you, Alex Jones reporting. I had a on there about how they're saying that the they're they're saying that the eclipse is racist. Well, I ain't gonna get into how what they're pointing out how it's racist. Other than it was the first time it was came around that bunch of eclipse came around it was uh, 18. Well, it was back in the beginning of our country. So, you know, like, oh, whatever. Whatever. They just pick on anything, everything, everything. What are they going to do? Tear the moon down? Let's put ropes on the moon and tear it down. That way it won't do that again. Because that's racist. <laughs> oh, jeez. I just 
kid about just I, I just can't believe what I just said. <laughs> oh jeez. Oh yesterday, yesterday, yesterday I did um start the ball rolling yet again because I did uh take time off. So because I was from my search my hip getting done. I took the time off because I knew I had new teeth removed. Well, my teeth is coming up. I gotta, I'll be having them removed the 20th next month. So I figured, you know what? I better get on the ball and start getting a hold of these doctors. Let me get them in because I'm going to have to re-see a cardiologist, re-establish a new one. I'm going to have to. I'm, I'm, I'm going to have to do a few things and so get things going on the ball. So that's what I spent yesterday doing whenever I wasn't out riding. Of course, by the time I got back in, it was too late to get a hold of the, my uh, dentist's office. So I'll be getting a hold of them either today or tomorrow. So I'm set an appointment after I get my te teeth removed. That way, uh, everything's all set up. Everything's ready for me to have them checked out. Okay, to release me to have my surgery. Which my, uh, my surgeon's... My hand man totally agreed this is the time to do it. He said, boy, you're really on my ball. I said, well, I, want, I need it done. It's not that I want it done. I, I want it done to get it fixed. It's not that I want it done. I, I need it done. That's it, it's, that, it's that need, type of need. So, I'm like, yeah. I'm not sitting on my laurels on this one. Of course, I wasn't sitting on my laurels before, was I? But, I mean, that's just how things go. He was happy about it, and I set it up. We were worried about getting the paperwork from his office down Pittsburgh up to where, well, up my area. And I'm like, well, you know what? Do you have uh, email capabilities? He said, yeah. And I said, well, just... The paper is just a general form. No, 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 you know, no information on it. Just, just a general form. Email it to me. So I said, then I'll just freaking print it out as many copies as I need. And he said that'll work out great. It's like that'll work. Uh, what the hell? Let's go ahead and just wrap this up. This is Muzzle Mike. Hope you all have a great day. Signing out.